Hello, Internet. Is this the root? I've noticed Facebook uh, made an announcement to change its name to Meta. You know, Meta. But they have not changed the domain name. Period. Why is that? Why haven't they changed the domain name yet to Meta.com or MetaBook or Metaverse or whatever the fuck they're going to do with it? Why haven't they changed the domain name? That's what I'm wondering. I'm really wondering. They should have changed it long since. But, you know, what are you going to do to cover up all the abuse that's happening in the platform? Rapid abuse that they don't want to stop. You know, the pollution by fringe groups. You know what I'm talking about, the extremist minority. Woke, awoke, awakened, awake, anti-vax, truther, conspiracy, QAnon, cringe, nine names for it, whatever, uh, besides extremism and all that, that's also way outside of the bounds of fringe, but, and, uh, Political interference, blah, 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 blah. You know that. Is it that? It might... Gotcha. Okay. Regardless of that, uh... No, they have not changed their domain name yet. From, uh, Facebook.com to Meta.com or whatever the fuck they're gonna choose. I've been very curious, because I don't really care what happens to a social network when, uh... You know, when I sign up with one. I tend to use it stay with the same network for a long time until yes and thankfully sometimes they shut down and that's happened with a few forums I used to use way back in the day uh, I don't remember oh yeah it's been way back I don't remember the name half the time but ah oxy forums it was more or less about oxy hosting but they're long gone long gone quite a few uh, forums came and left came and went you know some social networks came and went. Remember NetLog? Yeah. Remember MySpace? They revamped. They're completely changed now. Very, very different. And I do have an account up there, but I haven't really done much with it. Oh, whatever. Uh. Besides that, they have not changed the domain name yet. I wonder what they're going to change that to, to try and hide from all the abuse that's plagued their platform. I should put the camera in front of my screen, not beside it, because I keep looking at my screen. Oh, whatever. Uh, yeah, this video is in glorious 8K, even though YouTube does not support it whatsoever. Most video sites don't support 8K, it's only 4K. I tried doing this at 16k, but it kept gutting out at me at one frame per second or less, so... <sighs> Maybe it's the environment I'm in. Well, if you want to know what that is, it's this. See the window here? Yeah. Motif window manager. That's why. That's probably why. Oops. That's not supposed to happen. There we are. Yeah. <laughs> That's probably why it's not uh, gonna do it at 16k, so. And, funny thing about it, this thing stopped recording automatically, fucking up the original video. Only 23 seconds got captured, and I was rambling, rambling away. What can you do? Like, what can you, what can you fucking do? <laughs> I gotta keep an eye on that button. Ah, uh, besides that. From all the crap that Mark Zuckerberg has actually uh, been putting up with since starting the platform, letting it go out of fucking control, all the pollution by fringe groups, extremist groups, political interference, abuse, yes, abuse, cyberbullying, threats, blah blah blah, and all that bullshit that's been going on, infiltration, invasion by cults, and that. I don't know what they're gonna do. They're trying to sway themselves away from it. And move complete, trying to, you know, s separate themselves from it, but uh, that's not gonna happen. That is not gonna happen unless they change the domain name. And then, you know, the same people are gonna come right back. They're gonna say, oh, Facebook's down, they're gone. 
We're gonna look up the new name meta. Then, oh, it's back! Let's just log in. Let's just log in again. It's not gonna really do much, you know. They're still gonna fucking come back. So, what are you supposed to do then? Then they keep coming back. You're gonna keep changing your domain name again and 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 again. What's that gonna do? I mean, really. You can't hide from the abuse that you're appropriating and not dealing with on the social network that you created, Mark. You're not. No, no, really, you're, you're not going to be able to hide from that abuse. So, suck it up. Deal with it. You can change your company name all you want, but it's still going to be associated regardless. Regardless how many leaks happen. And I'm well aware of that shit. I just haven't read through it yet. I don't know I really care too much. But yeah, those whistleblowers, they're not fake. Thank you. Pardon me. That was a burp invasion. They're not fake at all. Those whistleblowers are fucking real. They are for real. They are from your company. And yeah, they blew that fucking whistle. And for good reason too. So, what are you going to do about it? Nothing. Nothing at all. And for those that are on the bandwagon of DELETE FACEBOOK! I'm not going to do that. And plus, I've already tried multiple times over. Do you want to see the history on that? Do you really want to see the history? I'll fucking pull it up and show you. Let me just launch this. And I've tried hundreds of times to delete it, but it just won't fucking delete whatsoever. Okay? You want to see it? You want to see that? <laughs> you want to see that? You'll see. I've tried multiple times over. It didn't fucking work. I can't delete Facebook. No matter how many times I tried, I cannot physically delete it. And you saw for yourself, I can't delete it that way. No, I'm not going to delete my account. There's no point in doing that because pages, there's so many businesses that use pages. And if you forgot, Facebook owns Instagram, Oculus, and WhatsApp. I don't use either of those subsidiaries. I don't really give a fuck about them. I don't care about about virtual reality. I don't care, really. It would more or less uh, upset me if I did care about it. So, I'd rather not. You know? I'd rather not. And again, I'm going to try and delete Facebook again. So here we go. Oops. Let's switch over to the screen. No, I can't take Facebook off. Oops. I don't think that even switched. Well, I tried removing it again, and I can't delete Facebook. Sizzle apps purge, or sizzle apps remove Facebook.com, or Facebook. No, it returns nothing. It gives you an error. You can see in this freaking terminal. Right here. Gives you that error right there. Can't remove it. Sorry. <laughs> not gonna happen. So, not delete my Facebook account. And, uh, no, it's pointless. And for whoever did, then, uh, what else are you gonna use to market your business? Oh, no, huh? Gonna try to subsidiary Instagram? Well, that's Facebook too. What's up? Oh, that's Facebook too. You're gonna have to delete those too. You got a page, you're going to delete that too. 
And you're gonna have to use Twitter. You're gonna try those alt net sites? Those alt net things? Good luck with that. Really. Good luck with that. Good luck. That's not gonna work either. Because you know how long those last? Look what happened to Parlor. Look what's gonna happen to the alt nets. Same thing. They don't survive. Give it a year, or two or three, or five. They're done. They're off the face of the internet. Sorry. You know what alt-net actually means. Look it up. They don't last too long. Fringe does not last too long. And it does not get taken that seriously. Alternatives, yes. But when they, as soon as they start getting polluted by batshit conspiracy theories, nah, that's it. People want to avoid those immediately. Because they don't want to attract, you know, dubious nut cases to their businesses because that's not going to give it a good name. Anyways, I've rambled on enough. Thank you for watching. Feel free to subscribe for more. Yes, subscribe, not subscribe for more. And I'll catch you on the next video. Over sharpened and all. Cheers. Maybe I might over sharpen it even more to make it look all pixelated. Hmm. Maybe. I gotta try that out. Cheers.